Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you guys for watching. Today we're going to go ahead and compare 4G versus 5G on the same exact phone, on the same exact network. Let's go ahead and get this review started. All right guys, so today we're comparing 4G to 5G on the same exact phone. Our model today is the S20 Ultra. This is made by Samsung. And if you can see there, the way you can tell is by the lens. That's the Samsung. You got the Samsung logo there. Same color, same exact model. And we are on the T-Mobile network. So this is a very good comparison because it's the same exact phone, same exact network. So you can see eye to eye what the difference is. All right, so if you can see here, the one on the right has a 5G symbol there going in and out. Then on the left phone, you got the 4G Plus, which is 4G Advance. So off the back, what I'm noticing is that the right phone with the 5G has three bars. And then the left phone has two bars. So we're getting a little bit better network there. But we're going to go ahead and do a speed test right now. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and open up the speed test app. Made by Ookla. And then we're going to go ahead and hit the go button and compare them. So if you can see here in the bottom, we got the T-Mobile network. And then T-Mobile network. So the same exact. So now we're going to go ahead and compare them both. So they both went to a Riverside Tower, but one's just LTE and one's a 5G. Okay, so these are the results here. On the left, on the 4G Advanced, we do have 0.29 on the download speed, which is the 0.29 megabits per second. And then we have 2.90 on the 5G. So let's go ahead and test it again. All right, so this is our second attempt to go ahead and test it out. So let's go ahead and get started. This is the Inland Empire. I do live in Paris, California. And uh, that's why you see there on the right hand side a 5G. It does say Riverside, California. On the left hand side, it did pick up a tower in Ontario, California. So that's further away from my home. So let's go ahead and find out what's going to be faster. All right, so we got the results here. 4G is 0.62 on the download speed. Upload's gonna be 1.97. The 5G is gonna be 1.04 download speed. And then on the right, it's gonna be upload speed 0.77, which is it's just really slow, honestly. I just, I guess I'm not getting really good service out here, but at least you can see the comparison there that the 5G does win of course and the 5g i have noticed the improvement from my old 4g phone my old 4g phone would buffer a lot every single time i would watch a youtube video and with the 5g i have no buffering whatsoever it's dependable it's under the t-mobile network so at least you kind of get a an idea of what's faster here and of course for me the 5g is a lot faster it's a lot better, it's a lot more dependable. Even though we're not getting crazy fast speeds, you could at least see what the numbers are. 
they're not too far off where you do have to automatically spend the extra hundred dollars to get a 5g phone but for me i know it's gonna go ahead and uh get just better so i wanted to get the new and more advanced phone and 5g capability in order for me to be able to have the fastest speeds that i need all right guys i hope this video helps and gives you an idea please share this video please like it subscribe so i can help you guys out with more things